This is one of the most favorite interview questions of React interviewer. The question is, when you click this button, how many times the component re-renders and what will be the final count value after these three states update? So when you click this button, React starts handling your click event. Now when you call state count to count plus one, you might think React instantly changes the value of count, but it doesn't. Instead, React just remembers that you want to update count. It puts that request into a queue. React thinks these updates all happened in one click only. Instead of updating after each one, I will wait until this click handler finishes and then update everything together. This waiting process is called batching. When your click function ends, now React looks at the three updates in the queue. One of your updates says it count to count plus one. But here is the catch. All three updates are using the old value of count, which is zero. So the final value of count is one. After processing all updates, React says, okay, I'm done batching. Now I'll render the UI once with the final value. So React updates the screen once showing count equal to one. It will render the component only once and the final value is one, not three.